I am delighted to join you in celebrating International Women's Day 2022. Today we celebrate the role and achievements of all women, women around the world, women in Africa, and women right here at the African Development Bank Group. The theme of this year's International Women's Day is gender equality, today for a sustainable tomorrow. This theme is consistent with my long-held belief and position that no bird can fly with one wing. To fly and soar higher and achieve accelerated development, every nation, society or institution requires the strong wings of women and men. But for too long, women have been relegated to the margins of society. However, in spite of monumental man-made limitations, they have and continue to make tremendous contributions in every sphere of human endeavor. Now, I am an unrepentant, an ardent champion for women's rights and gender equality in Africa. Women are the backbone of our economies. Women run Africa. And when women go to farm, they feed Africa. They make up almost 70% of the agricultural labor force of our country. However, they also bear the brunt of the impacts of climate change. That's why the African Development Bank Group is mobilizing $25 billion in climate finance to support climate resilient and low carbon projects. These projects will strengthen the climate resilience of some of the most vulnerable communities and for women in particular. Because when women thrive, everyone will thrive. The African Development Bank Group is making tremendous progress with our flagship program, which we call the Affirmative Finance Action for Women in Africa, or AFAWA. Last year alone, we disbursed $450 million to support women-led businesses. We plan to disburse an additional $500 million in 2022. These funds will also be used to boost the businesses of women all across the continent. At the African Development Bank, we are exceptionally proud of our women. More than 800 of our 2,000 plus colleagues are women. This is 23% higher than when I commenced my first term as president of the bank in 2015. These numbers also include 18 women at an executive level. Now, each of our hardworking and innovative women are incredibly strong role models. Their respective ways, they are paving the way for more women to follow. I appointed a woman as my senior vice president. Three women are providing leadership as vice presidents. One as vice president for agriculture, human and social development. One as Acting Vice President for Finance and the Bank Group's Chief Finance Officer. And one as Acting Vice President for Regional Integration and Business Development. I appointed four women as Director Generals, out of a total of seven Director Generals. Now that is 57% for women. And we have many women as Directors and Managers. Now, we are not where we want to be yet, so we will keep on improving. On that note, let me take this opportunity to welcome our 34 incoming young professionals, 23 of whom are women. Now, that is 68% women. My commitment to expanding opportunities for women at the African Development Bank Group remains as strong as it has always been. That's because I'm convinced that women make the world and the bank a much better place. So let us continue to support women everywhere and provide increased opportunities to shatter the limitations of any man-made glass ceilings. Happy International Women's Day 2022. Thank you very much.